I'm almost done with finals now, so it's uh, a bit of a weight off my chest, and I'll be able to uh, think straight, uh, other than uh, not having to uh, think about school and uh, studying. Uh, and I won't be feel guilty for wanting to make a video or just comment on something because I haven't been just haven't been thinking about it. I wanted to try and concentrate as much as I could on school. Um, but I wanted to comment just a little bit on the movements I've been seeing on YouTube uh, with Cosmic Zen, of course, um, and also uh, O Docta. Um, doing the uh, Army of Good, uh, and there's been several others that I can't re remember specifically, um, but a lot of people are trying to do movements of some sort uh, for Liberty, Logical Party, I like the Logical Party, um, and I was just, in my head, I can see revolutions approaching. Uh, I can see the restlessness, the um, dissatisfaction with the way things are, at least as far as government goes. Uh, I still, of course, we have video cameras and computers and iPods and cell phones. We've got all that kind of neat stuff uh, for distraction. <clears throat> and yet, despite all these distractions, uh, we're becoming, and as a good thing, less and less tolerant of the bullshit that politicians and lawmakers and authority figures and the classic status quo uh, were more and more, or I should say less and less tolerant of their activities and actions. Uh, and I've been racking my brain trying to see the future, I suppose. Uh, uh, on almost everything else I can imagine a reality for that particular aspect of life uh, like uh, technology uh, health uh, things like that, uh, mostly technology I suppose where you can kinda of project your thoughts of the future and, and get some sort of feeling for what it's gonna be but when I think about revolutions and governments, I'm having a, difficulty imagining the different effects of how life is going to be. Uh, Steph Bot, I think, does a fantastic job. I don't agree with everything he says. Uh, I, I would love to sign on to his vision of what could be, uh, and I hope that's the way it will be, but it's hard to just get a feeling for it. And I'm just wondering if anybody out there, if thinking of politics, what do you think the future is going to be if, say, the government falls, if we're not overrun by China? And I'm not saying they would do anything worse than we are. I, they're another form of government, and they do just fine as far as government goes. Uh, but if this government fails, and we try, are, are we going to try and put in a new government? Are we going to try and go without government? Uh, I just, I can see how people are uncomfortable, because it's an unknown uh, and I haven't really put a lot of serious effort. I, I spend most of my time thinking about uh, future gadgets and things I want to invent or be part of. Uh, uh, fantasies about, you know, being a giant brain floating through space and sending out little Sean probes to different planets to experience factions of life on with all kinds of life form. Uh, but it's always been independent of others. Uh, personally, of anyone that has, not authority over me, but an equal to me. It's always been, all my kind of daydreams have been me by myself, or with a small group of close friends. But in reality, it's going to be 
in conjunction with everyone else. Uh, so now that I'm starting to seriously see more movements going on for revolution and change, uh, actual change, not political party change, uh, I'd just like to hear somebody say what they think it's going to be, or if they have any idea, or if I'm the only one that's kind of uh, lost. <laughs>